Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. It's Cynic Alex. And today I wanted to give myself a challenge for you guys to see, but a lot of these single player types of missions, world boss, world boss ultimate, like stage one and etc., uh, Shadowlands, stuff like that, are not that difficult. Uh, and especially they're not difficult given the powerful characters that I have at tier two. A lot of times people ask me to do like a tier one Shadowland clear, but I'm at the point in the game where it's not really possible for me given the fact that I already have over two-thirds of all the characters tier 2. I have 111 out of 153, so it makes things like that very difficult. One place that I can still do it, and one place that is still rare in the sense that it's not around all the time, and I like it for that reason, is the World Boss Dimension Rifts. I know we've done this before, but I want to do it with a few underwhelming tier 1 characters. So I know you guys have seen my tier 1 Shadowland stage clears with uh, Moon Girl. I'm going to try it and see if I can actually manage anything with her uh, and just see if I end up wasting 20 energy or not. And then I have a couple more uh, characters that I want to try it out with, but this is basically what I can do to make the game challenging for myself outside of extremely uh, cumbersome content like Extreme Alliance Battle uh, and stuff like Conquest, which I find thoroughly annoying. Uh, the good thing about Moon Girl, uh, she has two or three, I guess, iframes. The first one is actually her first skill. Uh, the second one is her fifth skill. And the last one is Devil Dinosaur. So it's actually really nice. Um, and she's pretty much only usable uh, consistently for something like Shadowland because of the fact that uh, you can see the dinosaur really doesn't do very good damage. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. I got hit on the... I got hit as, they, as the pillars came down. She really doesn't do good damage um, otherwise, but... Uh, the other problem is that because Devil Dinosaur is always around, he's constantly giving... Uh, oh, and now he's dead. Well, I was going to say he's constantly giving... Wow. He's constantly giving a target, but he can't give a target if he's dead. Please don't. Please don't take any more damage. Girl. He's actually dead again? No, he's not. She's just He's just targeting me. He's just being a jerk. Okay, got it. Now we get the summons. We really need to do more dan... Oh, boy. Okay, now Devil Dinosaur is dead again. That's not good. Gonna double up on the iframes here. Really just need to kill him. Okay, we're going to the last stage. This is actually pretty difficult. Um, obviously, I chose a character that's not particularly good. But uh, even knowing what I was getting myself into, this is a little bit rougher than I thought it was going to be. And here come the four Meteors. It's probably going to kill Devil Dinosaur. Wow. Really? Oh, now he's dead. Okay, there's there's the roar of the dinosaur as he as he rips in peace. Okay, he's back up. Nice. But now we have the problem of a lot of summons. The good thing is she has a damage proc obelisk. I don't know where he is. Oh, meteors again? Really? No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh. The damage is really sad. That was like 10,000 damage. Her fourth skill does good damage. Okay, so we have three minutes now to kill Black Dwarf. This is pretty brutal, you've got to admit. The thing that I worry about is uh, Black Dwarf going into his, like, rage mode. Oh, he's not doing anything. What the hell? He was just standing there. That was so weird. I don't think I have any chance of ever breaking this, this bubble. She does mostly physical damage, so I'm just going to have to iframe. And then chip away. Oh, boy. Okay, so now he's dead. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, nice. Oh, he gets silenced. Oh, wow. Oh, right, they, they get status affected. They get affected by status stuff. Oh, right, I totally forgot about that. Yeah. Poor devil dinosaur. He's getting beaten up hardcore. No, 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 no. Okay, I want to switch just to get the bleed off. I don't want to actually use Hulkling, although I actually might have to. That wasn't actually that bad. Okay. Okay, we have a minute and 50 seconds. We're kind of running out of time right now, but I think, uh, sadly, Moon Girl is my best chance of clearing this on time, which I don't think we're going to have enough time for now that I'm looking at the time. And he's going to go into his thing again. Oh, no, he's not. I really wish he just did more damage. Maybe if we had if we had cleared uh, Ebony Maw faster. 
I can try to be a bit more aggressive with the skill rotation, but yeah, I don't know if we're gonna have enough time. See the red. Oh, I was too early. Shoot. The other problem with, um, well, the other problem is Devil Dinosaur's dead. I need you around, Devil Dinosaur. You have to protect me from the other dinosaur in the room, Black Dwarf. I guess if I could damage, if I could time the damage proc, actually, you know what? I might be able to do this. If I could time the damage proc, he died again. Seriously, dude. Oh, what the hell? He just like jumped in the air. That was super weird. Oh my gosh, I'm actually pretty close. If I could get some, oh my gosh, if I could get some some serious damage proc action, I could actually do this. This is insane. He's doing all this weird stuff where he like dives down. Oh no no no! Oh dear. Okay. I think it's the second skill has a knife frame. Yeah, the, da the damage is like a joke. Yeah, no way. Oh my gosh, really? <gasps> really? Really, 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 really? White tiger, white tiger, white tiger! Baby, what are you doing? Yes! <gasps> yes! <gasps> wow, okay. <laughs> this was totally unplanned. I had no idea it was gonna be that close. I legitimately thought I would either die in the first minute or two or I would clear it in like three minutes but that was literally as hard as it could get for me that was amazing okay let's do one more that was incredible I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as I did because I legitimately have not had this much fun in Marvel Future Fight in a while and that's saying a lot okay we're gonna go with Killmonger here uh, he was one of the other ones that I wanted to try we're just gonna give him a 30 percent uh, attack leadership and hopefully that's enough for him. A lot of people are still trashing the character. Of course, he's a paywall. We expect him to be very powerful. He does have penetration on his fourth skill, but he hasn't seen any meta play whatsoever. Not an Extreme Alliance battle. I haven't heard or seen any conquest in highlight of, of his. Um, I think it's his second skill that has the buff, but man, his damage is just so garbage. Right, his... Um, oh, no. Yeah, it's his second skill that has the buff. He does have a lot of iframes, which I guess at least, at the very least, that's good, right? Like, it, I, Hyperion doesn't have that many iframes, uh, but his damage is really low. Even with a 30%, and even with the uniform, and even with uh, his own damage buff. Like, look at those numbers, they're so sad. Oh dear. The cool thing is he can just kind of stay attacking. Okay. He can just stay attacking because of all the iframes, right? That's the oh I'm frozen that's what oh, that's what happened okay I can I can kind of almost just oh dear I can kind of just almost stay attacking aside from the wind up on his fifth skill um, I can kind of stay in Ebony's face the whole time oh I took damage there he doesn't have a damage proc obelisk so that's kind of the bigger issue. Okay, is he dead? Alright. I suspect, despite the fact that we did much better on, in the timing of that one, that this is going to be a lot harder. It's going to be a lot harder for a couple of reasons. For one, Black Dwarf does not like iframes. He hates them. So, fun fact, don't use iframes against uh, Black Dwarf if you can help it. Two, Black Dwarf has um, a lot of physical defense. So, I, yeah, see, this is the problem. I, obviously, I can't crack this shield. Now I just have to run away, because now he's got a, that blue bar up. Come on. I have to kind of just bait his attacks. There we go. Baited. Okay, there we go. Oh, the bleed. The bleed's not actually that bad. The bleed's about uh, 700 damage. I'm just worried about the last phase. When he starts doing the ground pound, I think I'm just going to get like two-shotted. And uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to iframe out of that. I also worry that he's going to start doing the ground pound because, yeah, like, he might do it right here. Yep. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so this is probably going to be a no-go with Killmonger for that. Just come on, Bucky. Come on. Bucky. Please, Bucky. 
Do you have to be this bad, dude? He should have been on my top 30 worst characters list. I don't know why Winter, Winter Soldier was not on the list, but he is just rough. War Machine's way better than Bucky. And again, that's saying a lot. That wasn't bad. That was like 50,000 damage. Almost. That is energy da energy damage. But that was pathetic. Alright, so we're going to have to switch to Killmonger here. We'll buff, but it's not really going to matter. We just iframe so we don't get hit by damage. We're going to switch to Bucky and just run away. Does the, fir does the first skill do energy damage? No. Okay. I was thinking maybe if it was flame. Do the grenades do energy damage? Oh, I can't tell anymore. He has the smallest iframe in existence on his fifth skill. On his fourth skill, excuse me. Come on, Rhodey. Uh, Rhodey. Run, Rhodey. It's just like you broke your legs again. Get it? Because that's what happened. <laughs> wow, he's actually doing the best damage right now. Okay, so this was supposed to be a Killmonger clear. But uh, it's Killmonger featuring uh, his best friends. And now it's just his best friends. There's the big slam down. Okay, last phase. Whew. Uh, really not liking the odds here. He's super charged up. He's got the Super Saiyan looks going on. He's probably going to do the ground pound here. Yeah. There it is. The good thing... Ah, no! I actually prefer... War Machine. No! Well, I don't have a choice now. Great. That's bad. Here comes the... Oh my gosh. You can do it, War Machine. You can do it. I believe in you. Just run away. <laughs> Alright. So, War Machine, Killmonger... And Winter Soldier, not a good idea. Not a good idea for a few reasons, mostly having to do with the iframe action and the fact that it's just not cool and it doesn't work. Uh, lastly, I did want to try uh, Rocket Raccoon. Uh, again, I'm just going to give him a 30% fine, a 30% uh, leadership and see if that's enough. I have a lot of energy, so don't worry about that. Uh, but I wanted to try Rocket Raccoon. For those of you that have Rocket Raccoon at Tier 2, let me know how he does in Shadowland because I've actually been considering Tier 2-ing him specifically for Shadowland because of the fact that uh, he does good damage. So I want to know if you can clear stages really fast with him or if I'm just imagining things or if it's something else altogether. What's the team up? I don't know. What's the team up? It's the first skill. That's not very good. Why did I get hit? I don't know. Questions that I will never have the answer to. The first skill does decent damage, though. I really wish that his heal would proc when he did any skill. I think he'd be a much better character if he could drop those heal bubbles semi-consistently. Um, did I just did I just stand there and uh, did I just stand there and dodge that attack? Wow. Like those heal bubbles are the heal bubbles are actually good. They're a thousand a tick, which is nice but then you don't get them that often because it barely triggers. It seems like it's triggering a lot right now, but in reality it's not. How did I how did I not get hit by that? Anybody? We're doing we're doing really well right now. Uh, if you asked me what would be easier, Killmonger or Rocket Raccoon, a lot of people would be like, yeah, Killmonger. Uh, just in general for game content, not necessarily um, this specific stuff, because obviously, nope. Oh, really? Really. Okay, fine. Oh, nice. I get the refresh. I don't want you to go into your... No. Yeah, I was trying to avoid that. Because now he just does that a lot. Okay, great. Congratulations. No, please. Okay, so we have an invincibility obelisk, but we don't have a lot of health. So that's kind of the problem. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Okay, wow. Yeah, yeah. Heal. Yeah, perfect. Okay, keep healing. Great. All right, now we have Rage Master to deal with. Okay. We just have to bait him out, and we have to just... Oh, nice. <gasps> oh, not nice, dude. Come on. What is your problem? Come Seriously? Really? I should have dodged that. I know. Is he going to charge? Where'd he go? Oh, he's doing this thing. I don't think... Uh... Oh, nice. 
Oh, I don't have an iframe. Oh, no, 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 no. Woo, four skill iframe, hello. He really needs another iframe, bad. The good thing is that number two and, um, nice. I need to get back to the heal, and it's gone. Sad days. Pretty good so far. Tough, but not impossible. Uh, I kind of felt like the Killmonger one was just... Okay, that's not fair. Stop it. Don't be unfair. No! Okay, uh, ignore the ignore the yelp. Uh, just, I just wanted to switch because Drax. I want to play with Drax. That's the only reason why. I really want to play with Drax. It's not because Rocket was getting bled. You're confused. It's okay. It happens. Oh my gosh. I keep getting the heals. But then I want to stand in and I can't. It's first world problems. Can you just stop? Oh my gosh. I, I just can't. He He's going to get hit by that. Oh, that was the wrong skill. Okay, now the problem is we're not doing enough damage. I can see that now. And the other problem is we're gonna die, so that's great. Okay, we need we need some uh, Modok intervention here. As you know, Modok is one of my most powerful characters in Marvel Future Fight. Uh, if you're thinking about tier 2 a new character, uh, definitely hit up the Modok Shop of Horrors. He is one of the best tier 2s in the game. Stay away. Or just die. How about that? How about that you how about you just die? Huh? Don't I have like 35 seconds left. It's not a lot of time, I'll be honest with you, but I have a feeling that we're going to die. We canceled his uh, ground pound, and now he's just going to kill us anyways. 28 seconds. We can definitely do this. We can definitely do this. Come on. Come on, Drax. I have very little faith in Drax. Is he going to do the teleport thing? Yep, there's the teleport thing. Oh, I need to switch. Oh my gosh. No! Drax! Drax, Drax! Do something, man! Ah! That was really close. If Rocket hadn't gotten hit, we definitely would have completed that one. So let me know what you guys think of the challenge. Subscribe if you enjoy the content and you want to support me. And of course, if you like what you see, I hope to see you again tomorrow. Take care.